In the modern Galaxy A series lineup, which started with the Galaxy A50 back in 2019, the Galaxy A55's premium design is unmatched by anything that came before. With the Galaxy A54, Samsung added a glass back, and with the Galaxy A55, the company added a metal frame to the mix. Combine that with the upgrade from Gorilla Glass 5 to Gorilla Glass Victus Plus, and you get an in-hand feel and build quality that's much closer to those of Samsung's flagship phones. However, the Galaxy A55 is a mid-range phone at the end of the day, and that means Samsung has left out a few upgrades fans would have liked to see. The worst offender in that regard is the size of the bezels around the display. As you can see on the screen, the bezels on the Galaxy A55 are massive. They are as big as the bezels on the Galaxy A54 and are in stark contrast to the symmetrical and ultra-thin bezels of the Galaxy S24, S24 Plus, and S4 Ultra. They are also bigger than those on some considerably cheaper Chinese smartphones that launched a year or more ago. Is this a knock against the phone and a reason why you shouldn't buy it? Not really. The Galaxy A55's design is excellent overall for a mid-range Samsung phone. It also boasts features such as IP67 water and dust resistance, which you won't find on most competing devices from other manufacturers, even those that are water and dust resistant tend to offer weaker protection. Still, the large bezels are disappointing and hold the A55's design back from true greatness. Samsung will probably address the bezel size next year as it's the only part of the design that hasn't been brought up to modern standards, but we would have preferred seeing the upgrade this year itself. Does the bezel size affect you to buy Galaxy A55, or are you okay with that? Share your thoughts in a comment and see you in the next one. Peace out.